that's dope, you know what I'm saying? Life is about second chances. I know sometimes I made mistakes that, you know, whether I didn't mean or I didn't know it was gonna go down like that. So to get a second chance is, is great. God forgives, we should all forgive. You know, Travis is a beautiful person. Um, inside, uh, best entertainer. Come on now. I love that, because I mean, <clears throat> whenever I started in Brazil, I was so canceled. Right now they love me, but in the beginning I was so canceled. I kind of think it created this expression in my country, but uh, yeah, I'm down, I'm down for it. And I'm down for the party too. It's one thing to hold people accountable and it's another thing to, I guess, demonize people because we all are human beings and people do all make mistakes. So I think that we don't really allow people room to grow or sometimes we don't even know a full side of a story and everyone just wants to, they're projecting and they're angry and so they're just attacking strangers over things they don't even know about and situations they don't even know about. So I agree that like sometimes it can get, like the wokeness can get a little bit overwhelming, like it doesn't feel authentic. Um, but I think I think it's all about the situation. I think it just all depends on the situation. People definitely should be held accountable. I mean, I think it's uh, I think it's interesting. I don't know if I can really. I don't know any of those guys personally, so I don't know. I think the I think the. It, it can be very draining as an artist. You know, there's people that try to cancel me for doing something that is very, I made a mistake, a little mistake that didn't hurt anyone. People are just very eager to, uh, I don't know, the online world is weird. I've honestly taken a little break from it, so. Mm -hmm.